The biggest scam ever invented by parents was an ease making their children send them, send them money in their old age. I repeat, you don't owe your parents anything. They were here before you and um, should have prepared for old age. Parents are always taking and taking. Stop the pressure. I did not say it. Up. It's coming from Noble Igwe. Noble, shut up. And I'm saying that with no respect. You may be older than me, but <laughs> I'm saying that with absolutely no respect because even the Bible says... Why do you think I... Noble is older than you? Mm. Yeah, Noble yeah, is a I young know. guy. Yeah, he's, old, he's a young guy, but he's older than me. He's, really? He's in his late 30s. I mean, oh, well, since 30s. when? Noble is like 35, 36, 37. I'm not up to that. Noble, okay, okay. I'm not, Noble is what? I'll, well, I'll have to find that out, but I don't think Noble is in the list that is in anybody. Okay, regardless, even if you're not older than me, verse, just shut up because even the Bible says, honor thy father and your mother. Uh, so no, honor doesn't mean spending money. No, though. wait. <laughs> secondly, secondly, when you say you don't owe your parents nothing, these are people that have invested in you. You are who you are today because of your upbringing. Unless you're saying that you don't owe any parent that didn't help you. I owe my okay, parents so a lot. Okay, so I'm hearing Noble is 41 years old. Exactly. Wow. So, yeah, so he's older wow, than me. Wow, wowsy. Wow. No, okay. no, that's it, wowsy. <laughs> yeah, wow. So, okay, um, I'm, I'm sincerely shocked. Yeah. Yeah, so um, if you're saying that your parents didn't do nothing for you, mm. then maybe you don't owe them anything. But not people okay. like me they, that... Uh, I, I, I think um, this conversation is sensitive. Actually, it is. For this part of the world yeah. it's no, not it is not up. let me be done we have heard you shut up <laughs> so it is sensitive for this part of the world because we have a culture yeah. right um if there is some sense in what he said and at the same time maybe the way he put it yeah it came across as you yeah. just being insensitive and not knowing yeah. what you're saying mm. i yeah. mean um i was even having this conversation which is why i was almost laughing while i was reading it i was having a conversation with a friend and it, he we hung out somewhere and we actually saw noble himself hanging out with some girls and you know chilling and he, my friend was like so but those girls are you spending money on did they do you owe them mm. anything so sometimes we it's just a sense of duty and the part where he said that they've been here a long time god rest my mom but she was someone who would always tell you that your education and everything you're doing now, don't think you're, I'm doing it or pushing because you because me, I yeah. want you to come and help me. Before you even think of taking care of me, you must have eaten and be comfort, comfortable mm. before you come back to help me. And yeah. trust me, I'm not going to, this is what she says, I'm not going to sit back to oh, wait, wait for, for you to help me because I have business, yeah, my right? Says, my dad but, says well, that. she's not here anymore, right? But that was the kind of mindset she said she had and she wasn't going to hold on for you. But but um, there are actually families that it make it a point yeah. of duty. Yeah. It's not just the parents who, if you are unfortunate enough, let me put it that way, to be the first child mm. and you have siblings, your life is to take mm. care of all that siblings. Mm. Except you're lucky enough, one of them becomes big and you know somebody helps you out. There are people that are on that serious pressure to take care of the family. and. It's, uh, it's, it's not necessary. I like the, the choice of words you're using, like sense of duty. Because if mm. you look at, 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 at Igwe's post, I think he said everything correct. It is a fact that you don't, you're not, it's not your responsibility. When you're bringing a child into this world, you cannot make them your pension plan. Mm -hmm. That's not part That's of That's why there's a pension plan. Yes. Mm. That, it's not part of parenting. But did he execute that message in a bit of a lashful way? Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. And is it dutiful? Is it supposed to be something that Pressure. a normal good child raised with that with sense should should do? Yes. yes. But the person it, he isn't wrong and he doesn't need to shut up. Yeah. But in this part of the world, we are more dependent. We have a dependent culture because we're not that sufficient in mm -hmm. terms of finances. So we all lean on each other, and there's nothing wrong with helping your family. We need to actually oh. go. Unfortunately.